You're quite safe here. Hello, Afflewax. Bag number eight. What ho, what ho. Uh, now, before we get started, I just thought I just wanted to give a little shout out to everyone in our gang who is currently having a bit of a rotten time. I just want to give you a massive, massive shout out. I won't name names, but I know who you are and uh, I think of you every day. And I just want you to know that... Um, you know, we're, we're, we're all here for all of you, and we love you all, and you're all flipping super and brilliant, okay? And if I just say, and I, I, I said this to, to Mike the other day on Twitter, but there was, honestly, last year, for the, the, from June to January, when I was so unwell and so miserable, um, it was... And, I'm, and I really don't say this lightly, it was you lot that was the only thing that was keeping me going, you and Georgie. That, I mean, that was it. That really was it. So, I'm never, number one, I'm never going to forget that. And number two, um, you know, if, if you are having a rotten time, we're all here for you. That's it. The Afflewax together forever. We're all in this together. So I just wanted to say that. So big shout out and big love to all of you who are having a rotten time of it uh, at, the, uh, at the moment. And all I can say to you is no hard day lasts forever. No hard day lasts forever. Never forget that. Right, we're starting with the Twitter hours today. The Twitter hours. Uh, Susan Barrett loves the girl. Hang on. Susan Barrett loves the girl. Susan Barrett. Uh -oh. Oh, I was momentarily bamboozled. <laughs> uh, she says, thank you for my cuddle. Oh, I mean, I'm telling you, I love giving cuddles. Uh, some say I give the best cuddles, and uh, I'm not going to disagree. And she says, Chanel number five. Ooh, get, get you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, not half, skipper fingers. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, he's, oh, he says he's, he, he's often summoned from the deep by the, the aroma of Chanel number no. five. Well, good grief. <whistles> That's how rumours start. Uh, Susan Barrett uh -oh. says, as I am particularly obsessed with the Lego doors and windows, could I request a specific notification whenever one is put together? I thank you. Ah, ah, I see. So rather like when I say light, Bevis, light, I could say door. Uh, Susan Barrett, uh -oh. door or window, Susan Barrett, uh -oh. window, all right, okay, let, let it let it move forth thus, thank you, Roger Maybanks, all fine, all fine, Roger Maybanks, all fine, uh, he says, Mother Goose, may I introduce you to Harold the Ginger Cat, He's from two doors up at number 44 and visits us regularly. Well, here he is taking an interest <laughs> in yesterday's RWB. Oh, hello. Hello. We've, got, we've now got cats uh, that watch Relax with Bricks. If, if you have a pet, any, any animal will do at this point. Um, who likes to watch Relax with the Bricks? Please send in your pictures. Thank you. Thank you. Little Sue. She's called Little Sue, the little, she called Sue, the little Sue. Yes, hello, I'm up. Here we go, another day. Another day to relax from the books. Yeah, it's another day, yeah, yeah. Are you, are you well? Yeah, I'm doing, I'm doing pretty well, yeah, thank you. I'm now on uh, day four of the, uh, the second 75-day exercise programme. 
Uh, I've done fit, fit Club has been done this morning. That's that's basic, basically what happens now here. Fit Club happens before breakfast. Um, so Fit Club has occurred. Uh, we're, we're 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 actually we've we've actually done Fit Club in separate places at the moment. Georgie Gibbon is in Wakefield. She's in Wakefield uh, with the Little Mix. Um, so, but so I was very impressed to see via my Apple Watch, uh, which informs me when she's exercising and vice versa. We, we're, we're, we're a tight crew uh, at, at Fit Club and we are allowed to talk about Fit Club. Um, but I was very impressed to see that, that she had done uh, her, her dailies. So well, well done, Georgie Kevin. Anyway, back to you, little dear. Back to me, please, boys. We're talking about Lego and not exercise. Yes, true, true, true. I mean, of course, please feel free to talk about the exercise, but primarily I'm here for the legu. Yes, you're here for the legu, yes. Um, well, carry on, please. Emma, um, uh, we need to discuss the brown pieces on this set. Can you please point to them? Don't point with your finger. Yes, thank you. Can I make the noise? Yes. <laughs> please point to them. These, I mean, I suppose they're not really brown. They're, they're what, what, what I would call a, 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 a taupe. Yes, a taupe. A taupe. A taupe. Mm. Yes, taupe. I mean, it's not an attractive colour, is it? I mean, this is why I'm here to discuss the, the, the use of this. Yeah, okay, yeah, all right, then. go on then, discuss it. Well, um, uh, I don't like them. I'm not liking the, 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 the brown slash two pieces on top of the white snow pieces. Oh, do you mean, oh, do you mean these pieces? Do you mean these pieces? Yeah, we, we'll get to this. I don't mind them at first, Emma, but I, I, I don't like the muddy effect, and I imagine some of them if not all, are supposed to be rocks. And I think it's spoiling the overall look of the thing. Well, um, I would say hold fast because obviously we need to see uh, the final results. And look, these ones have got holes, so I suspect there's going to be things happening here. Um, but let's, ho let's, let's, let's hold, let, let's, let's not dip our wick into whatever glory hell is available. Oh dear, that went wrong. Um, and we'll wait and see till the final result, I think, until we make the final conclusion. But I kind of feel, yes, I'm in agreement with you about the tote. Yes, I, did. I really hate the tote. Yeah, I mean, it, it's, I agree with you. It's nicer to have a crisp white finish, isn't it? Yeah, yes, this is what we like here, a crisp white finish, you know, the toopy toop toops. Mm. Well, I'm glad we've had this chat. Uh, please put that away. Thank you. I press the button. I'm really glad we had the chat, yeah. Uh, Mr. Claw. Yeah, the Claw is a mister. Says, Mother Goose, can I ask if my previous request for guardianship 76193 was entered into book of requests. If not, can I make it an official request, please? And thank you. Uh, Mr. Claw, you have nothing to worry about because I can tell you that it is it, it has landed in the Lego shed. It is in the Lego shed. It is racked and stacked, and we will be doing it. We will be doing it. It's racked and stacked. Okay? Racked and stacked, so don't worry. In fact, you know what? We could even do that next. How's that? How's that? Because I think you did ask a long time ago. So let's say that's going to be next build. We're going to do the Guardian of the Galaxy ship. It's very colourful, all, all those of you who are all going, oh no, it's not even remotely grey. So shush. Sharon Renzoli, Sharon Renzoli, Sharon Renzoli, Sharon Renzoli, Sharon Renzoli, Sharon Renzoli. I says, yo, could the spider web be a strand of Mother Goose's hair? Yeah, a 10 4. Mmm, crumbs, now I'm going to have to touch it. Oh gosh, I'm going to have to touch it. Oh, 
Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Yes. Okay. Well, that well that's good. That's good. You know, it, that's brilliant because that means we have not got a spider on the haunted table. Repeat. Not got a spider on the haunted table. Thank you. Well done, Sharon Renzulli. House points for that. House points. House points. Uh, Roger Maybank, so fine, all fine. Roger Maybank, so fine. <laughs> he says, making a start on the big up truck, Emma. <laughs> she says, I appreciate <laughs> this level of honesty. <laughs> so what happened was... <laughs> When I was taking apart the, the pickup truck, I was doing it by bag. And then I think I, I took a call or something happened and I got distracted a bit. And then I went back to it. And then when I got to the end, <laughs> there, was, there was some mist. I couldn't work out which bag they went into. So I did this. I did niblets, which are obviously the little extra books. And hang on, <laughs> which bag were these from? <laughs> anyway, yes. So thank, thank you, Roger. Thank you, <laughs> thank you, Roger. Just so as you're going through the bags, if there was a bit that you could, then then you can refer to that bag, of course, <laughs> to see whether that bit came in that bag. Um, Mike, formerly known as Tobin Mori J. Keep gathering email. Um, ooh, hang on, hang on. It's going now like this. It comes, sir. Thank you. Hang on, let me just assemble these little pieces. Um, Mike says, I think that the weird bell type of machine in the skate hut is an ice, sk ice skate blade sharpener similar to this one. Oh, look at that. Look at that. Oh, well done. Well done for spotting that. That's really good. Well done. Uh, Mr. Claw. <laughs> says, I think Mother Goose should not be admonished for pointing with her whole hand. It's more an offering up motion. So I don't think suits the pointy stick thing. Yes, I agree with you. I agree with you. Although when we were discussing the hue, I thought maybe I should have used this. The hue. The, the hue. Thank you. <laughs> I'm loving discuss, discussion of the hue. <laughs> um, then he says, Hatchy. Yes, I think that's it. Uh, Hatchy? He said in the name of the film that was renamed. Yes, I think it's Hatchy. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, Mike uh, says, OK, so Richard Gere starred in Hatchie, A Dog's Tale in 2009, which was a remake of Hatchie Co. Ori originally made in 1987. Hatchie was, an, was indeed an Akita. Yes. Thank you. Yeah. 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 Then Mr. Claus says, uh, here's the statue in Shibua. I'm, I've not watched the film because it'll make me cry. Uh, yeah, I'm with you on that. I, 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 I literally have a refusal at the water jump uh, when it comes to films about animals in which the animal might not survive. Uh, I can't cope with it and I will go into a decline. And I refer you to the time when I watched Wally, which Admittedly, it's not about an animal, but just about a lonely robot. I've also got a thing about any anything that's lonely, can't cope with it, can't cope with it at all. And um, I cried. I think I've told you this story before, but but when I watched Wally -E in the cinema, I cried so much, um, my breasts came out of my bra. True, that's a true story. They actually came out of my bra. I was heaving, sobbing, actually heaving with sobs. Can't cope with it. Can't cope with it. No, 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 no. That's going duh. No, I see, that's going comme ça. Hmm, hmm, all right. 
All righty. Uh, Mr. Claw, about a dog who waited patiently, who waited patiently at she boy station every day for his owner to come home from work, even after his master passed away. <laughs> I can't cope with it. I can't cope with it. Professor, a lego. Right, here we go. I have a question for our more medically knowledgeable Afawax. As we learned in the first video of this build, Marvin doesn't know who his dad is. No, he doesn't, no. We've now met a, a number of Carla's acquaintances. What kind of window are we talking about for them to all be valid contenders? Uh, here she comes. Scrub down, scrub down. Ooh la la, le requison. She says, I believe it's five days before ovulation plus the day of ovulation, so six days per menstrual cycle, not necessarily per month as it depends on the length of the cycle. Hashtag not a doctor. Hashtag nurses rock. Hashtag she's been busy. <laughs> she's been busy. Yeah, she's just, yeah. Car Carla, Carla just had. Let's just say it was it was it was a lost five days. Let's just say it was that she just threw hell to, hell to the wind and just got on with it. Uh, Emma. Yes. Uh, I'm afraid that you missed one of my messages yesterday, and I feel a bit sad they're dead. But at least they now have names. Uh, so could you please? Please read it out because it was missed yesterday. Your apologies for that. Yes, it happens sometimes, so don't worry. Yeah, thank you. Uh, so here it comes. Of course, I was talking about a name for the fishies. I have Ned, I have Ned and a Norman. Yes, you have Ned and Norman, yep. So perhaps these fishes are in, 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 in the hue. I could be called Debbie Dolores and Delilah. Yeah, that's very good. I will accept it. I will accept it, even though they are they are clearly dead, um, which is deeply upsetting. But yes, uh, Debbie Dolores and Delilah, uh, the dead fish who swim, who well they don't, they float, who float in the hue. They're floating in the hue. What a business. Uh, could Dolores be possibly changed to Friday special at Plaza? Rosie Lee, she likes her scones but not with cream. She likes her scones with jam. She likes her scones with jam, not cream. She's lovely, Rosie Lee, says with a side order of spidery Dave. Ah! 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 <laughs> Sharon, yo, mother goose, see midge, drop the M, edgida, that's the pronunciation, not the one you're using, egda, don't make me come over there, sis, yeah, a damn four. Yeah, okay, so, sorry, Sharon, it's really... Sherry, sorry, sorry, Sherry. Still get the most effectual, still get the intellectual. Close friends know he's clearly rust free. Fish fingers on pizza for tea. Still get the indisputable leader of the labs. Others get, others shed. He's a sky that can read. He's the most real, still, still get. Uh, he says, I think that's a Yorkshire word as well. He's given me some right agita. 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 Mm. Or possibly Lancashire. I can equally well imagine. I don't know why you've suddenly gone northern. I can equally well imagine Compo or Molly Sugden saying it. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Trevor Poulton is such a. Something's gone wrong here. Oh no. 
Oh, and it's another awkward spot. I've got to get that out. Oh, idiot. Idiot, Kennedy. There's no getting that out with that, is there? Oh, what an absolute error. Look, there's no getting it out. Oh, crumbs, this is a... Oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. What? Oh, good grief. This is a situation and a half. Take that out. Let's try and get it up. Oh, oh. Oh, good God. No. Oh, I... It's stuck fast. Oh, good grief. How do we get it out? Oh, there. That was exhausting. Thank you. Now it's correct. Thank you. Where did this go? Hasn't gone anywhere. Hasn't gone anywhere yet. That was our, that was our first minor panic of the build. <coughs> well, it wasn't really a minor panic. It was just a sort of a horrible situation. Uh, Trimble says, thank you for accepting the request, Mother Goose. Please don't feel the need for both sets. It was an either or request. I think you would like 60350 Lunar Base Research, Lunar Research Base better. It has a biodome, which looks great. Uh, then Neil, he hasn't got a thing to him, says 60350 looks fabulous, uh, Trevor, and could develop a recent RWB storyline along with the bill. Oh, hello. Brilliant recommendation. Hashtag Lunar Research Base. Hashtag a Biodome. Mm, that's very good. Well, I shall look into it. I shall look into it, my darlings. It shall be looked into. Hang on, let me just do in a little assemble of things that are happening here. I, f I feel like I'm not fully concentrating. You, not concentrate. Shh, be quiet. Honestly. Honestly. Must there constantly be this criticism? Must there? Good grief. Can't somebody just mildly get things wrong without being told off all the time? Can't they? What are we building here? I'm fascinated to know. Uh, Stony Soul Cat says, uh, Richard Gere films about a dog, an officer and a German shepherd, puppy woman, the collie club. Go, that cock. Oh, and wasn't he fabulous? An American Golden Retriever. <laughs> I see what's happening here. Neil and Bloodhounds. <laughs> then he says, don't forget the film of musical Chihuahua alongside Zelwiger and <laughs> Zeta Jones. Hashtag Razzle Dazzle. Hashtag we both reached for the gun. <laughs> Get that cock. What a glittering career of woof-tastic performances. Yeah, they, they are woof-tastic. There's no doubt about that. Utterly woof-tastic. A baby smashing. The sensei. I, I put that on the wrong way. Hang on. The sensei. I got a strawberry. The mini mini. The murderer. The little Harris. Her buddy. <laughs> Says, I love the use of the red roller skates to add some detail to the wall. Yeah, yeah me too, yeah. The ice does look yes less yellow with the lights off, so I think that's a definite. Uh, the rack of skates is lovely, but it does look like a bit of a health and safety disaster waiting uh, to happen. Mm. Yeah, I mean, you'd have them over in it just by looking at them, I suspect. Just by looking at them, they'd be, they'd, they'd be all off the wall. Mm, what are we making? Who knows? Professor, I like it. It's been a while, but I have a open bracket, mostly, close bracket, been tracking the sweet swirls. As Bricks and Places is terribly behind in the builds, I thought I would switch up the format a little. Oh, this is exciting. Today, I thought we'd take a look at suitcase number one. You better sing me up, and mother goes. Oh, this has been a while. 
A box of pussies, books, a pussies, a box of pussies, books, a pussies, a box of pussies, books, a pussies, a father, a father, da da da. Oh, good to have you back. Back to suitcase number one. Oh, this was indeed a new post for you, mother girls, when you saw it back in the boutique hotel. I'll just show a picture of it. Yep. Yep. This is its 12th outing since it was introduced back in 2018. But you can certainly see the travel theme and the sets and appears in our open bracket, which makes sense. Yes, 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 yes. Many figs can be found dragging their suitcase in two airports, a passenger airplane set, and for those with a flying phobia, a passenger train set too. Friends figures aren't left out with their own. Heart Lake City Airplane. Yep, there we go. Yep, lovely, lovely. Just as an aside, it's clear nobody in the Lego universe has to suffer the same nonsense we mere humans do when it comes to air travel and airport security. Not based on what buildings pass as an airport, anyway. Little bit of satire there. Yeah, little bit of satire. Once you've arrived at your destination, Minifigs are limited to stays at the boutique hotel for appearances of this particular suitcase. Friends clearly love more diverse travel though, getting to choose between hotels, beach houses and even a resort. I mean, I sort of, do you know what? I wish, I wish the Friends sets didn't have the awful Friends figures because there's some Friends sets that I think we secretly might like. And I will, I will now, uh, I will now accept. Oh, do we want to go down that route? <sighs> well, look, look how much we love the trolls. I, I will accept suggestions. Okay, I'll accept it. Let's have an open discussion, please. An open discussion. Heralding in an open discussion on whether we ever want to do a friend set on RWB. The open discussion. Let it commence. Open discussion. Thank you. Uh, for the more, back, back to Professor Lego, for the more outdoorsy type friends, still has you covered with a forest camper van and sailboat. So say what you like about the friends figures, but they know how to get out there and enjoy themselves. A little bit like the other wax, I, I would hasten to add. Prior to 2018, our Manifix only really had the classic mini suitcase to work with which also happens to be included in the Boutique Hotel. It isn't new to you. That event is attributed to the detective's office back in February of 2020. Yep, 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 we all remember that. Yep, yep. It has racked up 227 appearances in its now 39-year career as a minifig utensil, only being absent for one year back in 1984, the year after it was introduced. As for its first use, it was the 1983 railway station, and this set netted you four in white and two in earth orange. Will you look at that beauty? Hang on, let me put this piece in. Thank you. Carry on, carry on. Earth orange is how Lego uh, referred to one of their older brown colours, last seen in 20, 2006. It was darker than the reddish brown we know today, but not quite as dark as dark brown. Pretty brown now, for a colour that doesn't include the word brown in its name. With 227 cents, it's a slightly larger task to say anything meaningful about where the suitcase has appeared. But I believe there have been roughly 40 sets dedicated to the flight of minifigs alone, all of which do include this space to represent luggage. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We will finish up with a suitcase that stands apart from the others for a number of reasons. One, the suitcase piece is only part of the suitcase. You need a second part to complete the effect. Two, you will not find this suitcase in any set with an airplane or train. What? What could this piece be? I'm fascinated. I'm on tenterhooks. It's unique to CMF bind bags. 
Four is specific to a very particular theme, even within CMF. Five, it may be the only minifig suitcase with any print. Minimal, yes, but there's colour other than the base plastic. Six, the only place you can purchase it will be Bricklink. That's enough teasing. The suitcase is used in both of the Harry Potter CMF series, hence why you cannot purchase the piece direct from Lego. It's been designed so that a book cover is the other piece using the same clips as the fancy books as found in many Harry Potter sets. Will you look at that beauty? Wee! Woo wee! That wraps up this suitcase edition of Bricks and Bursts. Stay tuned to find out how long it takes me to write the next one. Sing me out, another guess. A books and pieces, books, a pusses, a books of pusses, books, a pusses, a books of pusses, books, a pusses, a fadida, a fadida, a fadida. Oh, that, that was an excellent one. Thank you for that. That was absolutely excellent. Really super. Thank you. Uh, Neil says, Oh, it's good to have bricks and pieces back. On form, prof, on form, hashtag bricks. And pieces. Uh, yeah, he's on film. He's always like, oh, look at, look at that for a lovely picture from Trevor Poulter. He's such a darling. Uh, Tatty, oh, Tatty Forrester. Hello. 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 O occasional poster, but hello. Uh, it says also ja Jacob Kowalski uh, from the same series. I'm loving that cinnamon swirl. Oh, that's, a, I don't think I've had that piece before. Oh, that's a lovely piece. Thank you. That's lovely. Thank you, Tatty. Oh, no. Oh, no. <gasps> uh, I, I just see the picture and then I literally get, go into a, 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 clammy, a clammy panic. Anyway, here we go. We've got an adjudication. Uh, hashtag Freedom Day has arrived. <gasps> hashtag the Ombuds Goose Speaks. Hashtag the Chosen Ten. From the office of the Ombuds Goose. Hear ye, hear ye. Freedom Proclamation. Freedom Day is upon us. All Afawaks to be released from Afawakatraz forthwith. The Afawak 10, now released from uh, incarceration, are to be rewarded for services to relax with bricks with an extended spa retreat, providing front row seats and views of the current build making these heroes a prominent feature for RWB viewers. Celebration delights to be served up by Little Sue's uh, Cafe. <laughs> oh, of course, there's a slight sting in the tail. Mother Goose to remain on probation. <laughs> and be sighted at the DJ booth on Spider Watch. Okay, thank you, thank you, thank you. He's adjudicated, thank you. It's adjudicated. Right, that means everyone, everyone's out. Everybody is out. Right, come on. Uh, we've got Gillian, uh, Bevis, Bevis. Um, come on, come on, tiny purple pig, out you come. No, no one's left behind. No one must be left behind. Nobody. Faye, Faye, come on, Faye. Uh, Faye, Faye's out. I'm oh, sorry, sorry, Faye. Stand Faye on set for the meantime. Uh, Tiny Purple Pig, you're out. Uh, Parry, you're out. Parry's out. Parry's out. Um, Ollie Gosling, out. He's out. Jackie Swan, uh, with, with new hair we have established, which she is keeping. Uh, she's out. She's out. She's out. Uh, Gail Adcock, out on the ice. Uh, Twi Twi Owlin, out. Um, Noreen Cullen, out. And, uh, finally, 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 uh, Kennedy is out. Right, okay, well, let's, let's do some sorting out here. Kennedy on decks. Um, now then, Rosie Lee, we're going to have to move you. And Sharon Renzulli, I'm afraid. Uh, you will have to go back to uh, bleachers for the time being, for the time being. For the t oh, no. Oh, 
that's good. That's <gasps> no, don't look at Rosalie's bald head. Don't look at that. Look, there we go. Rosalie looks absolutely tremendous in that hat, doesn't she? Absolutely tremendous work. Thank you, Sharon. I hope you've enjoyed your time. Uh, now, but I, who, oh dear, the, stuck to her buttocks. The seat is stuck to her buttocks. I must have to push that back now. Thank you. Uh, Renzuli, I'm putting you on the bleachers, but you can you can you can choose to sit somewhere else uh, if you so desire. Ollie, I'm going to put you back um, where you were before, which was next to Ray, on the on the on the lazy. Oh dear. Oh good. Oh crumbs. Oh gosh. Let me just. Yeah. There. Um. Gillian B, come on. It's arms up for here. To the spa with you, thank you. Gillian B, spa. Noreen, spa. Yep. Uh, Swan, oh, not Bevis over. He'll be fuming. He'll be fuming. Uh, Jackie, uh, arm up, Jackie Swan. Scream if you want to go faster. I hope you sit on there. Yeah, well, you have. Your, ha your, your hair is, has done you proud. Bevis can return to uh, his spots. He gets a pretty good view there anyway. Uh, Parry, Parry uh, will pop you, uh, oh dear, pop you there. Sort that out later. Harwood, I think you'll, you will want to go back to your, uh, to, to, to your private spot. Faye, um, pop you there. And Faye can go there. And Gail Adcock uh, can go there. I mean, that's that's a super arrangement. Well, well done, everyone. You're all out. You're all out. All the applause. Well done. You're all out. You're out. Um, uh, thank you, Ombuds Goose. Uh, thank you. Thank you. He has adjudicated. Uh, uh, thank you. Thank you. He's adjudicated. The adjudications have concluded. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. <gasps> well, I've gone to the Google eyes. We've, we've got a new Apple Whack. Over on the Google eyes. Uh, Taryn D. Hello, Taryn D. Hello. Hello, Taryn D. You're very, very, very welcome. Welcome, 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 welcome. Uh, Taryn says, uh, love your channel. Oh, thank you. Uh, the bell type thing in the skate shop is a skate sharpening wheel, I would think. Oh, thank you. T you see, look, the confirmed, conf the, the suspicions of Mike, formerly known as Tomori Jig, who got the wrong email, now confirmed by new Affleck. Taryn D. Oh, Taryn, stick around, please. We love it. We love a new uh, member of the gang. TVZ. Oh, <laughs> Uh, so, oh, I do love it when they do a, a bit of pipage, don't you? Uh, she says, uh, ice glory hull, ice glory hull. Oh, how you do excite me. You're glistening ice. It does entice. Fish, ice fishing is my hobby. I live to drop my fishing pole into your deep, cold, icy hull. <coughs> ice glory hull, ice glory hull. Ice fishing does excite me. Uh, there's a little fishing ditty to the tune of Oh Christmas Tree for your edification. You're welcoming. Oh, well, I'll have to sing it properly. Let's have a drum roll. Ice glory hole, ice glory hole, oh, how you do excite me. Your glistening ice, it does entice as fishing is my hobby i live to drop my fishing pole into your deep cold icy hole ice glory hole ice glory hole that's what she does Suddenly creeps up on you. How funny is that? <laughs> 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 
and I do that you was a from again. Really? I remember it. It's your really young bee. Said I would love for Mother Goose to spend a weekend with Sharon Ranzuli and learn New York. Eh? I mean, that's the dream. I think it would be a super fun weekend for both of you. Thank you for the orange puck facts. I said puck. <coughs> Little Sue, try saying puck facts fast. <coughs> puck facts. No, don't even, don't even tempt the Lego gods by saying puck facts again and again and again. <coughs> now, puck facts. Fresh poisson for the poisson poisson. Could be fish from this glory hole in the pond. The skates are so cute. Yes, they are. That concludes the business of the club. <coughs> Do you know when you think about? I, I, I think about other, other, uh, other Lego channels, and you just think, what are they doing? Just, just whizzing through a build. What are they doing? Just waste. Just what a waste. Oh, the joy you bring. The joy you all bring. Right. I mean, I was, I was thinking, I did think at the start of today that we'd be doing um, another bag, but no. I don't think so now. That's instantly spruced up the colour, hasn't it? Well, I'm glad everyone's out of Afawaka Trust now. We 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 do, we do, we done the crime and we've served the time. Nice. I, don't, I still don't know what it is, but suddenly it has become rather lovely. I'm interviewing someone for a job today, which is uh, something I've actually never done before in my life. Um, applicants for to be the new administrator of the parish council. Oh, no, 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 that's going there. No, it's not. No, it's going here. Voila. Oh, I wonder if this is the roof. 
suddenly thought to myself, Where's that going? That's going... Hmm. Ah. Yep. Down. That's the roof, isn't it? How lovely, how lovely. Now we whip that round. Come sir. And that's. That down, yes. Oh look, hasn't, hasn't, hasn't that jollied, jollied that up? Really nice. Oh, light Bevis. 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 Bevis lights. Bevis. Bevis. Bevis lights. There's two of those. Bevis. Bevis lights. Bevis. Hey. Oh. Thank you. I've momentarily bamboozled. Thank you. Light Bevis. Light Bevis, Bevis, Bevis lights, Bevis, Bevis lights, Bevis, Bevis lights. Uh, voila, well, that's lovely. Um, oh, we've got three minifigs tomorrow. <gasps> How exciting. Oh, I can, oh. Mm -hmm. I think we might be getting the uh, number one suspect tomorrow in uh, the um, Marvin paternity suit, but that will all be revealed. Uh, subscribe, like, tell your pals. FOX forever. I will see you tomorrow.